Hello guys, welcome back and welcome kung bago ka sa channel na to. So, pag-usapan naman natin ngayon is transforming quadratic equations into its standard form and finding the values of A, B, and C. So, meron tayong napat na examples dito. For example, number 1, 2x plus 3x squared is equal to 5. So, transform natin into standard form. So, ito yung standard form ng quadratic equation. ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to 0. So, now, dapat na una yung x squared. So, una natin yung x squared. 3x squared. And then, next is yung x. Plus 2x. And then, yung constant. So, transpose natin. Magiging negative siya. Then, equal to 0. Okay? So, naka-standard form na siya. And then, para sa values ng a, b, and c, so yung a is yung katabi ng x squared na number. So, that is 3. And for b naman, yung katabi ng x, that is 2. And for c, yung constant, yung number. So, negative 5. Okay? And for number 2, 4 plus x squared is equal to 5x. So again, nauna dapat yung x squared. And then, yung x. So lipat natin again, transpose natin, naging negative siya. So negative 5x, and then yung constant, plus 4, is equal to 0. Okay, so standard form na siya. And then, yung values ng a, b, and c. So yung a niya, yung number na katabi ng x squared, that is 1. So pag wala siyang number, ibig sabihin ng 1 siya. So 1 yung a natin. And then for B, yung number na katabi ng X, that is negative 5. And then for C, yung constant natin, that is 4. Okay? And for number 3, so 2X times the quantity X minus 1 is equal to 6. First, simplify muna natin. Okay? So distribute natin yung 2X. So 2X times X, that is 2X squared. Minus 2x times 1, that is 2x, is equal to 6. And then, so lagay na natin siya dito, 2x squared minus 2x, and then lipat natin yung 6 sa bila. So magiging negative siya, is equal to 0. Okay, so standard form siya. And then, yung values ng e, that is yung, katab yung number na katabi ng x squared, that is 2. And then yung b, Yung katabi ng x is negative 2. And for letter C, that's constant. So negative 6. Okay? And for the last number, quantity x plus 1 times the quantity x plus 4. So simplify muna natin. So foil tayo. First term times first term, that is x squared. Outer times outer, x times 4, that is 4x. And inner times inner, 1 times x, that is x. And then last term times last term. 1 times 4, that is 4. And then simplify natin yan. So x squared, combine like terms, 4x plus x, that is 5x. Plus yung constant 4. C equal to 0. Okay? So, Ito na yun, naka-standard form na siya. So, x squared plus 5x plus 4 is equal to 0. Okay? Then, hanapin natin yung values ng a, b, and c. So, a yung katabi ng x squared, that is 1. b, yung katabi ng x, that is 5. And yung c yung constant natin, that is positive 4. Okay? So, comment below guys kung nakatuloy yung video nito. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like this video.